All right, so here we have Tune Hopper. You can see the small icon right here. I'm going to tap it. And we open up with our company, Guilt Free Games. Now here's our loading screen. Now we have options and share. Options gives you sound effects on or off. I'm sure a lot of people will use that. <laughs> Display scale. It'll be letters on or off. And we have help. Going into share, you're allowed to friend us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube, and share the game on Facebook and Twitter. Now the best part, play. Gives you a display of albums purchased with in-app purchases when you hit the get more button. Now let's try to play an album. Going to Greg's Rhymes, this is more for kids. We have things like London Bridge, Old MacDonald, Brother John, and you have max score for each song with levels. Let's try Brother John level 1. The way this works is you have a musical scale. This scale for the song is in G major. And you can see here the melody is G a, B, G. This is a scale of eight notes. Let me play this again. G, A, B, G. We made up part of the song. We did well. Now if I hit play harder, I can hear the song playing right now that I just made. Brother John. And Greg gets rewarded with food. We have a perfect score. I hit play harder and our song gets longer. And now we add the new part. Again we hear the song and we get rewarded with more points and food. Alright, let me show you Brother John with the full song, level 5. They get longer as it goes, level 4 and level 5 now has the full song. When you're at expert level 9, you cannot see the glows or letters and it's all ear training from what you hear, you tap it out on the scale tiles. Medium level 5. You can see the playing is faster and the glows actually disappear instead of remaining on the board for you to tap. Those are all steps, and here is a skip. On the scale, I step up, step down to D, down to C, down to B, and finally down to G. As in a piano scale, there we go, top G, we have here the letters G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G, G, D, G, so the educational factor of this is intervals and you're also doing intervals on a certain scale to promote ear training. All within a fun Simon Says style gameplay.
So if I go Brother John again one last time, and I go to Expert, level 9, after you have gone through 8 levels, you are now accustomed and also trained to the letters and tones and tiles you should hit. So Expert, let's try this. It gave me the first option. It's giving me hints along the way as it plays the full song. Now there's a familiar melody here and we also know the steps and skips needed to create our melody on our scale of eight tiles. So let's try this. Using my ear, I'm able to pick out steps and skips. As in the piano, where it would be different keys, we are just using different tiles. So if a child reaches level 9 with Tune Hopper on any song, we can guarantee that they are using musical memory to pick out the tones with intervals on a scale that is training their ear to finish their song even on expert level. We have a perfect score, no wrong notes, level play 9, score of 790. We have maxed out Brother John and we can move on to another song or another album. Just quickly, our albums include classical themes, Paco Bell's Canon, Rondo a la Turca, Blue Danube, and many more. We have patriotic tunes, Johnny Comes Marching Home, My Country Tis of Thee, Dixieland, and we have originals that belong to Tune Hopper, a fun collection of songs. We have songs with chords in them. All of these. And we have, of course, kids' rhymes and beats and more snack tunes, which are, again, original songs. And that's one of those songs in Tune Hopper. Thank you.